lot of surveys have shown that Australian cities are actually a great place to live. I mean, the Economist survey recently ranks uh, Melbourne, Sydney and Perth as being in the top 15 uh, cities in the world. And Australia itself has got a reputation internationally with surveys of being a very livable place to be. Uh, but we do know, when we look at the detail, that unfortunately they're unsustainable in terms of greenhouse emissions, in terms of oil use, in terms of congestion, uh, even in terms of water use. I mean, we're right up there with the, uh, the highest, the worst polluters in the world. We need to start looking again at cities and looking at a coordinated national approach to our cities. How do we move towards efficiency, smarter operation, new ways of doing things within the city so that the city not only continues to be livable but it remains efficient and cost effective? ACF has a proud history of being able to build uh, strong and successful partnerships with industry and with government to be able to achieve stronger and more effective environmental outcomes. The problem with the debate now, particularly around our cities, is the environmental, the social and the economic outcomes are starting to overlap like they've never done before. So we really need to be able to bring in industry as part of this conversation to achieve a positive and effective outcome. So this way we're able to bring everybody along on the journey and use ACS leverage from a policy perspective, use the knowledge of the industry and combine that together to achieve policy outcomes and economic outcomes that are just fantastic for the overall built environment. Our vision for this is to establish a group of progressive business voices to talk about the need for the decarbonisation of our cities, focusing on energy, water and transport as the key leverage points for how we decarbonise our cities. The value of collaboration is it's an unlikely alliance of business and community groups coming together to achieve a particular purpose in advocating for a better society in this case for smarter slimmer cities. And we learn together, we walk the journey together, and we come out at the other end developing policies that all of us as organisations own because we've actually developed those policies together. We've got a great need and opportunity to ensure our cities in Australia are more sustainable. At the end of the day, that'll be good for the environment, uh, good for our economy, and it'll help make our cities more livable. Uh, but we really need creative thinking and really need to rally an effort behind this. So I'd like to invite you uh, to become part of a round table really promoting smart cities in Australia. And I think together we can make a very big difference.